Hey guys, it's Trevify here, and in today's brand new video, I'm gonna be showing you guys me spending a load of money on the Fortnite item shop. And if you guys don't know what is in the item shop, basically what's in there right now is all of this stuff, which I own most of it, but I might buy a few things. I own like all of the uh, ninja stuff. Yeah, I own everything in there. I own Red Jade. I'm not gonna buy this, and it's uh, money, not V-Bucks, and I don't want to spend more money, because I already have a bunch of V-Bucks, as you can see up here. And, uh, let's see. I already have Cuddle Team Leader, because I've had her since Season 2. But I don't, I don't really like any of that stuff. So we have Gage, we have Face Palm, Jumping Jacks. Pretty decent looking. Switch Step we own, Saxy Groove. Faucet, do not own. I kind of like the skin. May, may not buy it. I don't know. It depends how much money we're going to have after we buy the entire Star Wars shop. Now, that is our goal for today's video, is I'm going to be buying the entire Star Wars shop. Except maybe one or two items, which might be the TIE Fighter. Well, actually, I don't know about the TIE Fighter, but I'm going to get all the skins. I'm most likely going to buy this right here, so that I can get all the skins. And then I'm definitely going to buy the Riot Control Baton. Definitely going to buy the Traitor Emote, but I do not know if I'm going to buy the TIE Fighter because of how loud it is. And I don't know if I'm going to buy this because I don't really care for it, and I'll probably never use it. The Resistance Thumbs Up. I'm probably going to buy the TIE Fighter just to own it, and it's 1200 and I love Star Wars. And TIE Fighters are like one of my favorite like First Order and Imperial, uh, what do you want to call them, like spaceships, I guess. And I don't really care for her quarter staff. I mean, it looks really cool, but it, like it's kind of loud here. Just take a listen. But then again, you can't really judge it in the uh, lobby because they sound way different in here than they actually do, depending on what you hit, whether it's like wood or metal or brick. So, as you can see, I already have my 13,500 V-Bucks from my wonderful dad, who I love very much, and he buys me a ton of V-Bucks and crap, but I actually haven't spent money on this game in forever. I stopped buying stuff a while ago, so you can call this a freaking early Christmas present, I suppose, but basically we got the $100 pack so that I can get, like, all the Star Wars stuff that I want and save it up for the leaked stuff. If you guys don't know what the leak stuff is, I'm showing some of it on screen right now. So, there's like the new Frozen Legends pack, which I believe is... I actually don't know what it's called, but it's got like a Frosty Nogops. The guy that destroyed the map in Season 9. And then, uh, what else is there? There's, um... Uh, what was it? Uh, Frozen Fish Stick. And then there's a Kramp uh, Krampus might be coming back. I really want that. There also might be, um... What's that one guy called? There's like a husky guy. He's pretty buff. I don't know if I'm going to buy him or not. There's a really creepy, skinny, candy cane looking guy. There's a ton of leak skins. I'm showing most of them on screen, but I'm not doing a voiceover. I'm actually recording this while... Like I'm, like, I'm talking while I'm recording this, so I'm not doing a voiceover, so I can't actually see what I'm putting on the screen right now, but I know what I'm going to be putting on the screen right now. I just don't know the names of it. So, as you guys could just see, those were all the leaked skins, so I'm going to be saving up for them, too, which is why I'm not going to buy the entire shop, but I'm probably going to buy 90% of it. So, to start off, I'm going to make sure that I have creator code Trevify in, so I'm going to punch that back in. Creator code Trevify, use your boy's code, and then... We are going to head over here to the Rise of Skywalker pack because it's worth 4,500 V-Bucks for all three skins. And I really, really want these skins because they may not come back. And I really want the Ray skin and the Sith Trooper. And it'd be cool to have Finn. I don't really care for this skin, but I really want the Sith Trooper. So, let's go ahead and buy this. Voila. There we go. Take some screenshots. Oh my. Okay, so we got some screenshots there. So now we have... If we go here, I'm going to favorite these so that I do not lose them. So we have the Finn skin, former Stormtrooper, and now committed Resistance member. Part of the new trilogy set. Also, the event is happening tomorrow. And make sure you guys enter that event because you guys will get a free Whisper Glider, which looks like 
this right here. It's like a TIE fighter, but it actually has wings that go like to the side of it and stand out more. And it, it looks pretty cool. It might be loud, it might not be loud, but it's an exclusive glider that you're only going to get from this event. And this event's most likely going to happen once. So I say that you guys get on around 1.30 Central Standard Time. For me, at least, it's like 1.30 to 2 o'clock. I don't know what it is for you guys. You guys can look it up and be like... I don't know, you can probably find it on Reddit or something. And then we have the Ray skin, a scavenger now studying the Jedi ways. I remember this girl in the, not the latest movie. Actually, I think it might have been the latest movie. I don't even know. I haven't watched the latest movie. But in one of the newest movies, but Kylo Ren, I remember her. She was like, basically crashed her ship into the desert in the middle of nowhere. And then she basically started studying the Jedi ways and started getting the force. And I really care, like, I really care. I really like this skin. It's a pretty simple skin, and it just looks really, really clean, and yeah, I'm probably going to wear this a lot in future videos and stuff, so on to the Sith Trooper. I really, really like this skin just because of the fact that he actually holds the scar in the lobby. I really, really like that, and not only that, but I really, really like the Stormtrooper skins. Like, I have the classic Imperial Stormtrooper right here, which I'm going to favorite that. But I really like the Sith Trooper. I really wish that they would have put the Mandalorian skin from the new Mandalorian uh, series, the uh, Star Wars series, on Disney+. Plus. I really wish they would have put that in the game. I was even commenting on their stuff to put it, but why would they see my comments? Actually, I was like the fifth comment on their uh, thing about all these skins coming out, so... But I really wish they would have put the Mandalorian in because he just looks really, really cool. And he's, like, really sick in the movie. Like, he's, like, a boss, pretty much. So we have the Jedi Order. I really like these back wings because they're, like, holograms that are just floating and they look good on practically everything. So I'm going to give these some favorites. And I really like the blaster from the Sith Trooper because it's just, like, it kind of looks like a tack shotgun. But it looks way cooler. And it looks like a crossbow at the same time with that ADS that he has. And I really like that addition. Not only that, but we have the Resistance symbol. Symbol of the Resistance. Part of the new trilogy set. This looks really good on the Imperial Stormtrooper. Or not the Imperial Stormtrooper, the Sith Trooper. But I want to see what this blaster looks like on like Renegade and stuff. Because I feel like it'd look pretty good. Yep, it looks really good. I, I had a feeling that this would look good on most skins. And I just like it because it's a new addition, and it's just like, he's basically got a gun on his back, which may become a new thing, having, like, guns on your back. So, obviously, like they had in, like, the old Season 1 uh, loading screen, which I do not think that we own, but I'm gonna check, where they had, um, like, the pickaxes on their back and stuff while they were running. Oh, actually, we do own that. Right here, as you can see, we have the pickaxes on the back and pickaxe on the back, as you can see. So we have two guys here with pickaxes on their back. This never became a thing, and this has been a loading screen since Season 1. This was the Season 1 loading screen. And then they gave it to us in Season 3 in the Battle Pass, which was the first Tier 100 Battle Pass, which featured the John Wick skin. But they didn't actually call him John Wick, they called him the Reaper because they didn't have, like the rights to actually make it Keanu Reeves, so that so they didn't, and recently they did, so that's why we actually got a Keanu Reeves skin. Anyway, let's go back to the item shop and spend some more V-Bucks, because we've only spent 3,500 so far, so far, not so far, and we have got six items already, but if you just want to count skins, we've gotten three, so we already have Finn, Ray, and Sith Trooper, so this one is closed off. I really want this baton, so I'm definitely gonna purchase this right here, right now. It sounds really clean, and it just looks very cool. So as you can hear, it's pretty dope. So I'm gonna purchase that right now. All right, so now that we have that purchased, we are gonna not cancel it, we're gonna go back. We are gonna, uh, let's see, we're gonna favorite that and equip it looks very cool let's see what it looks like doing point it out which is the emote where you point your pickaxe which is i believe i just saw it there it is oh that looks very nice it's not in his hand but yeah it still looks really cool though but epic you kind of need to fix that there's kind of a uh-oh stinky with that trader is the next thing we're going to purchase i really like this emote I really like this emote, it's really cool. So we're gonna purchase that. Alright, we have the trader thing. Trader emote, not trader thing. 
I'm gonna put that instead of my clown, because I don't even use the clown. Let's favorite it and equip it. Alright. Now we still have 8,500. So let's see what else we have in here that we can purchase. We already have the baton, we have Finn. I can buy the thumbs up. I don't really know if I want to buy the thumbs up though. Because I have the OG thumbs up and I don't even use it. And I feel like if I buy this, I might not use it. I want to see what it looks like from like. I mean, it's kind of funny, like, if you knock someone and you did it, I feel like it could be kind of funny. So, like, I'm just gonna get it, because why not? And I think having every single thing of the Star Wars series will be a pretty cool addition to my locker. So, why not? We're just gonna purchase it, favorite it, equip it. Alright, now, let's see, what else do we have in here? Alright, we have the TIE Fighter, definitely gonna purchase this. One of my favorite, like... Uh, battleships, drones, whatever you got, spaceships, not battleships. I literally just said battleships because I was looking at something on Instagram. I am actually dumb. Anyway, we bought the TIE Fighter because it's one of my favorite, like, spaceships in the game. And I really like it. Even though a lot of people have been making memes on it saying, oh, it's really loud and stuff. I still really like it. And 90% of the gliders that I use are loud just for the memes. Like, I have the Royal Dragon, which has, like, firecrackers and stuff explode randomly. And then I have Jerry, who just freaking screams a re in the microphone. So, yeah, that's Jerry if you haven't met him. And then... Let's see, what else do we have in here that we can purchase? So we have everything except for, I believe, Ray's pickaxe. Which is this right here. Now, I, I don't really, like, care for this, care for this. But, like, at the same time, I kind of feel like I might as well just get it. Because at this point, I've spent most of my V-Bucks, about half of them. And kind of the video is titled and based on me buying the entire Star Wars item shop. So, I think I kind of have to buy it for you viewers, and I think it might look good with Renegade Raiders, so I'm going to add it to my collection, because why not? And even after purchasing this, purchasing this, even after purchasing this, I should still have a roughly about 65, 6600 V-Bucks, somewhere around there. So, we are going to add that to our collection. Voila, we now have Ray's staff, so we're going to add that to our favorited because Star Wars is the best. Now, I don't really care for anything else in the item shop other than what I already own. See, now, if I didn't own, like, Red Jade or uh, Kuno, I would definitely purchase them. But I'm not going to purchase them because I already own them. And to purchase them, I'd have to gift them. Which, I don't really feel like gifting stuff. And I'm saving up for all the leaked skins because some of them are really cool. And there's a lot of really cool leaked emotes. So, I'm going to wrap the video up here, guys. But if you guys enjoyed this video, please smash the like button and subscribe down below with post notifications on. Do not forget to ring that bell. You guys want to actually watch my videos and want to be like the first commenter and get a free cookie. Or if I ever do random giveaways, the first commenter is most likely going to win that giveaway or get a huge bonus entry in that giveaway. So make sure you guys are the first commenter on my video. No matter what, I do this every video. Just make sure you guys are the first commenter on the video. And if you are the first commenter, you don't have to comment first, but you can. I will send you a cookie reply, a cookie emoji reply. And that's how you know that you are the first commenter. If I send you a single cookie emoji with no text or anything, that's how you know that you are the first commenter. So... Make sure you guys smash the like button and comment down below if you guys want me to do a video on doing a in-game kind of before you buy of the Ray skin, the Sith Trooper, and the Finn skin. If you guys want to see that and the TIE Fighter and these pickaxes in-game because they sound kind of loud, then please smash the like button and comment down below that you guys want to see that and I will make that happen. So without further ado, I'm going to end this video here, but don't forget to use your boy's creator code TREVIFY in the Fortnite item shop. It resets every two weeks, so don't forget to put it back in the item shop. And I hope you guys have a good rest of your day, morning, and afternoon. Peace.